my goodness. so red. Oh! All right, guys, it's time to get this giant red tail catfish into its new pond. <laughs> Let's catch him up. Woo! It's catch him up fishing with Zach. Ketchum. Look at this fish. Catch him up. Yes, guys, the merch is available and the website, the link is below. Guys, thank you so much for the support. You guys have been at for a long time and we're going to have many, many drops, guys. Let me know what you guys want on this merch. It's going to be on the front, on the back, and I'm taking some designs from you. So leave the comments below and we're going to make it for you guys. Thank you. Enjoy this episode and catch them all. Glasses not included. Guys, we just went bow fishing with Paul Caffaro. Check out Paul Caffaro's channel, guys. We had a lot of fun. Paul actually shot his first tilapia for the first time, fed his fish, saving a little bit of money Christmas season. I love my little brother, Paul Caffaro. But guys, today we have Wild Water Farley. He's helping us out today while my truck gets serviced. What's up, Farley? Where are you at? What's up? Wild Water Farley today is helping me out because we, you guys know we have this massive pond. It looks amazing four level pond that we build if you haven't seen that pond build guys check it out in videos prior because we have the entire thing set up so you guys know how to do it at home we have some animals in here already actually Farley, you want to go ahead and grab me the uh, net over here there's a cold front coming it's december 1st and we just got the worst forecast of all time it's about to get seriously cold for our outdoor fish guys as you guys know we have willie over here just chillaxing not in our deep level pond we have this just in case we catch something giant and we need somewhere to put it really quick and train it etc etc but we have willie where are you right here straight down guys come here willie i know right come here willie come here baby how you doing baby check this guy out just a really happy red tail catfish but it's getting cold this water is not freezing like i said it is connected to the lake but unfortunately this lake is a lot smaller than the one behind my mother's house who takes care of all my fish does a great job for me as you guys can see willie's swimming around freely he's plenty fine right here but he's finally eating i'm sorry i didn't get that on film for you guys but you know it is what it is he's finally eating out of my hand he's very comfortable and now willie needs a new place to go back to and which is an old place which is exactly where he's going oh he's gonna bite oh, oh, what <laughs> <laughs> but yeah guys so this catfish is now friendly i feel like he's not going to be as aggressive in the other pond with the other red tail catfish guys he's been meeting new friends he's been meeting some very very lovely young ladies around the kitchen wall pond yeah, yeah. the swarm is definitely getting big guys our catfish is ready to go guys he's trained i wanted to make him a little bit more friendly i wanted to take him out of that larger pond with the other red tails which he had a little bit more competition he's a little bit more friendly he's not spooked anymore as you guys can see i can pet his tail look at that thing he's happy and i can put him in the other pond and i feel like he won't be as aggressive towards the other red tail catfish that was our mission of having him in this pond but i'd rather have him in a much larger 18 by 9 foot pond then this what is this eight by three and a half four feet so we're gonna take him out now bring him back to the other giant pond i know you guys have missed that pond farley's gonna help us out we're gonna take this giant red tail catfish and put him back in his bigger home all right that should be good right now hold on a second guys hello all right Guys, this is a wild Joey Slam on the phone with me. I'm not sure if you can hear him right now. I'm gonna put him on speaker. Joey? Hey. What's going on right now? Dude, I need help. Why? My fish is getting beat up by another fish. You got room? I got plenty of room now. I'm moving my red tail right now, guys. Right, I'll come over right now. All right, how long till you get here? I'm here. Oh, really? Here. Oh, yeah, he's right here. <laughs> <laughs> so Joey, a little ill, and Raul are here, guys. We're gonna go ahead and put that red tail catfish in here with a little bit of assistance and a very, very small net. So oh what I'm gonna do, God. I'm just gonna hurt him. <laughs> And I'm just gonna lift them up. So All right. let's go. Let's do the Just back up, back up, back up. We we oh, gotta yeah. get them over here. The heck is that? Someone's like building Santa Claus back there. Just I don't want to hurt his fins. That's why I'm, I don't really want to mess with his that other net. Just want to hurt him. Come on. Come on. So you have your marble of Yeah. He's in the car right now. Oh wow. Oh, that's a big fish. Come here, buddy. Come here. Oh, that's a big fish. Oh, that's a monster. Did you get him? Oh, he's right here. Oh, okay, right. okay, stay right over there. Look at this. Okay, what I'm gonna do now, I'm not behind him. Gonna stabilize his tail so he doesn't hurt himself. One, two, follow me guys at home. Water, water, water. water. He's so red. Oh! Put your glasses on. Okay, ready? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, 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 relax, relax. One more, guys. One more. 
Not, but not. Oh. Okay, ready? Okay, one more. Oh, oh my one God. More. One more. No one's oh, hurt. Right, we're good. No one's hurt. No one's hurt here. He's good. Me. He's good. See, oh, we didn't hurt his fins because this has such small holes, guys. But you can also see why we named this one Willie. Look at that. Look at the color. So defined on this catfish. So defined. So we're going to hurry up, get this catfish over to the bigger pond with all the larger fish. It's already been in there. It's already happy. It's already healthy, guys. We're going to do that right now. But we're going to see how big Joey's marble acara is. We're going to put him in that pond before we leave. So let's see what Joey has. We got the whole squad out here. We're examining this fish right now. See he seems to be a little bit beat up. Yeah, I want to see it, bro. Oh yeah, he is beat up. He's totally beat up. Look at that whisker. Yeah, check this out, guys. Zoom in to this whisker. First of all, he's letting me touch it like that, which is a bad sign. Check that out. It's all beat up. This yeah. is a beautiful Marlboro car, though. There's tooth marks on his tail. There's tooth marks on his tail. Oh my God. Oh, well, we'll see that when we take him out. Yeah. We're gonna take him to the back right now. Examine him. Put him inside the larger pond. Hopefully, the lake water heals him out and being isolated from the other fish. Joey. Slam has some new giants in his pond, guys. Obviously. We haven't seen that in a long time on my channel, but if you're subscribed to his channel, check it out. It's it's pretty crazy. You good, bro? You good? All right, one more second and we'll take you home. So, this emergency just came up out of nowhere. Literally, out of nowhere. Yeah, apparently his fish just been attacking this marble car, guys. And it's time to see him go into the new pond. This is a very pretty fish. And you can see this is a lot smaller of a fish, guys. This fish is going to have plenty of room in this side oh. pond. Massive. So, let's see what you were talking about, how messed up he is. Yeah. Let's see it. Let's see it. I want to take a step back over here. Look at these there things right here. Look at that. You got to see it nice and slow. Oh, my God. The marks. Look at that. Oh, my God. Look at the blood. Look at the blood on the bottom side. Look at the blood. Oh, oh my goodness. That. Owie. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Aggression. They're trying, he was getting as big as my biggest fish. Oh, this poor fish. So they've been fighting for aggression yeah, yeah, the yeah. alpha. So right now, I just need him to heal up. Dude, let the dude, other dude. guy become alpha and everything. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. It's okay. Look. Look. Wow. Look at that. That thing is so badly damaged. It's dude. crazy. What on earth? I can never hold this Marvel car. And yeah. that's how you know it's yeah, like really bad. Tired. All right, so uh, what you're going to do now is you're going to place them inside the, the pond? Yeah, I can put them in the pond. Which you one? You want to take some pictures with your phone and camera and stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's cool with you, yeah, can I get fine. some from my channel Go too? Go ahead. Easy. Easy, girl. Oh, ready? She's about to move. There you go. Hi, Big girl. Those whiskers are all torn up. That's why I love these fish. They have these long whiskers and everything. But here we go. Alright. Plenty of room. It's very Plenty deep. of room. It's yeah. like the perfect isolation pond. Absolutely. If anything ever happens, I'm gonna start putting like fish over here because it's constant flowing water and everything like that. I appreciate you, bro. Hey, no problem. Thanks, man. Ah, the ice. Alright guys, it's time to get this giant red tailed catfish into its new pond. <laughs> no, nah, I'm just kidding guys. We're going to take it over to my mom's pond, lake water all day. The chlorinated water, you know, fish could probably survive in that. Maybe for a second or two, but it's, it's time for going to go. It's been a long time since we took you guys over to the pond, although it's been every day for me. Look at these guys. Hi, babies. Hi, don't bite my finger. Hey. Oh, <laughs> Everyone is super, super happy, super healthy. All the arowanas are eating pellets, they're eating everything. Everyone's jumping, everyone. Actually, one of these guys just took a girl's finger off the other day. Didn't you? Didn't you? <laughs> yeah. The cold weather is coming, guys. And honestly, this week is gonna be one of the coldest weeks we've had all year long. So the winter's coming. We gotta get our big monster into this pond with the rest of these monsters. And hopefully he plays nice with the other red tails. Hey. What? We got a little visitor right here. Hey, Graham. Hey, look, check it out. What? Merch. How's this look? Oh, oh yeah. Wow. Oh yeah, baby. Give me some skin. Yeah. <laughs> Love you. Well, guys, what we're gonna do right now? I'll have you taking all your groceries just in just a second. Just gonna make sure this guy is safe. Well, nuts. Go ahead. Oh, he's good. He's relaxed. Look at this monster, guys. This is Willie. <laughs> this has the most predominant white stripe on the side. That's why we named this this guy Willie. Hopefully, he's good. Come here, baby. Now, red tail catfish like this are slippery under their heads, but they're not slippery at all by their tail, so they're easy to grab for the most part. And like I said, guys, before previous videos, this, the, the, pectoral, the pectoral fins will absolutely just demolish you. I've done such a good job of not hurting his fins right now. Yeah. It's not that much stress. 
can just lift. Okay, ready? There he is, there he is, there he is, there he is, there he is. Bring it with me! There you are, buddy. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of difficult. <laughs> You're so skin yeah, yeah. <laughs> Guys, so now you guys can see, check out the other red tails. I'm not sure if you can see that with the glare, but they're coming, they'll come right up. If the air wants, does it bite me first? Hey, baby, you're good, you're good. You wanna bite me, little guy? Oh, no, buddy. <laughs> Guys, if we put all these fish together, this water is much, much warmer than the water of that smaller lake, the smaller pond behind my house, guys. These guys are doing absolutely perfect. The water is crystal clear, direct sunlight, vitamin D, all the tilapia, all the fish food, amazing pond. I love this, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. This was really, really tough to me, honestly. <laughs> Willie is just a behemoth. Je definitely, by far, the biggest uh, it's sexiest <laughs> that I've personally caught in the last couple months guys. I love that thing But guys we have a lot to do because there's actually a leak in the bottom of this pond We have to fix it before we lose all these fish because in the winter time you have no time for any errors guys So stay tuned for the next episode guys check out the merch the link is in the description below catch them gear catch them gear and catch them all catch them all Woo!